What's going on guys, Scope Scripter here, back with another video, and in this video I'll be teaching you guys how to make a donation GUI in Roblox Studio quickly and easily. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do is you actually have to publish your game. So if you don't know how to do that, I'll be doing it right now, so don't worry. So right up here you just press File, Publish to Roblox As, Create New Game, and then you can change all this stuff however you want. You can change the game's name, its description, its creator, so you can set it to a group that you're in or a group that you own. You can set the genre and whatever devices you want it to be supported on. So for now I'm just going to call it the donation game and I'm going to leave everything else the way it is. So I'm just going to press create. So it should give you this little message right here. You can either press the X or close and it should just shut itself. Um, but yeah, so your game has now been successfully published so we can start. So the first thing you have to do is you have to insert a dev product into your game. Now, to, the, doing this is not hard, but it's less obvious than how to make a game pass. Basically, what you gotta do inside your game, go to this little home tab right up here, and then find game settings. You're gonna click game settings and it should open up this little tab. In the sidebar, go to monetization, and you're just gonna press create right under there. So, one problem with this that I've discovered though, um, by using developer products, sometimes it might glitch and as you can see product ID is empty, product name is empty, just like everything's missing. If this happens to you, just press create a second time and all this stuff should fix itself. But for most people, it should just appear first try, um, but yeah. So once you have your developer product, just go press these three little dots on the one that you want, press edit. Now you can change the name of your developer product, so I'm just going to do donate 10 robux that seems like a fair price so down here by price you can do 10 robux and save and there we go so now that we have that we can make our GUI so let's go to start a GUI I'm just, just gonna hit that little plus button hit screen GUI and here hit this little plus button and hit text button so now we have a text button in our game so the next thing you're gonna do is just insert a local script into your text button by the way guys, if you want to edit this text button, you can do that, okay, it doesn't matter. You can edit this text button and make it look different by using the Properties tab. You can access the Properties tab by going to the View, and then Properties, this button over here. Now also, if you don't have this tab right here, the Explorer, which that's probably an issue, I should have mentioned that earlier in the video, all you gotta do to open it is just press View, and then Explore, and then we'll just open it right up. But anyways, guys, we're going to go to our text button, press the plus button, and insert a local script. And inside the local script, you're just going to write this right here. Now, guys, the script is in the description. I'm not going to force you to write all this. You know, I'm not evil. So, yeah, you guys can just go grab it from there. One important thing, though, that you have to do is right here, these numbers, you have to put in your own Game Pass ID, your own product ID, I should say, because this isn't a Game Pass, it's a dev product. So how do you get the you know product ID, you may ask. All you gotta do is go to Home, open up your game settings again, go to Monetization, and then down here you see Donate 10 Robux, your dev product. All you gotta do is just hit these three buttons and then copy ID to Clipboard, and we'll copy this product ID. And if you just wanna copy it manually, which I don't know why you would, but you know, let's just say you would wanna do that. Right here, there's this little thing, Product ID, it lists all the IDs. So I'm just gonna copy to Clipboard, and then right down here, you can just replace it just like that and now if we join the game what should happen is if we press the text button it should in fact bring up donate 10 robux and there you go would you like to donate 10 robux now guys inside roblox studio this is obviously a test purchase so if you buy in studio it won't take anything so i'll just test this a few more times and obviously since it's a dev product you can do it how many ever times you want and that's pretty much it it's fairly simple actually um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If this helped you out, definitely leave a like and please subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. See you guys in the next video.